Hey Jaysmar, good morning, how are you today? Uh, so I wanted to make this video to uh, practice the content for Exxon 6, okay? Going to the supermarket and how often? So the first part uh, is how often. We're going to practice frequency, okay? So remember that there are two uh, uh, types of frequency expressions. There are there is uh, the general frequency, and the other is the specific. So the general frequency are words like always. For example, I always go to work. All the time, I go to work all the time. Often. I often go for a walk on weekends. Sometimes, example, I sometimes go to the pool. Every now and then, I travel every now and then. And never, I never eat shrimp. So, to help you remember, every now and then means um, de vez en cuando. And often uh, means um, uh, a menudo. Um, now, something important is that the words that are one single word, like sometimes or never, go after the person. Like I sometimes, I often, or I never. They are one word. Now, once the expressions that have two or more words, like all the time or every now and then, go at the end. Is no I all the time. No, it's I go to walk all the time. And I travel every now and then. Do you understand? Single words go after the person after I, and uh, three, two or three words go after, at the end, after the verb, okay? So let's continue. Then we have specific frequency. We had general and now specific frequency. So we have the times, one or two are once and twice. And after three, you, have, you say three times, four times, and five times. Then you have a, a day, a week, once a day, once or twice a week, three times a month, four times a year, or five times a semester. Got it? So, how often do you go to the supermarket? Here you have the order, the order of the words. How often is the frequency question? Do uh, means the present time. You is the person and go to the supermarket is the action. So if I asked you, how often do you go to the supermarket? You say, well, I go to the supermarket twice a month. Now to this, you can add the frequency, right? So you can say um, often. Let's say, I go to the supermarket often, comma, twice a month. Let's, let's add that. So, so you can, I go to the supermarket often, often, twice a month. Do you understand? Then we have the third person. How often does the Leska go to the beach? She goes... Remember, goes to the beach three times a month, often also. She goes often to, she often goes to the beach, comma, three times a month. How often did your sister do photo, show, photo shoot last month? They did photo shoot 12 times last month. Because this is asking about the past, you are not going to use general frequency, okay? Because this is uh, this is talking about the present. So you just say, um, 
they did photo shoot 12 times last month. Okay, now we have an activity. So you're going to answer, how often do you read, do yoga, clean the house, study English, go to the supermarket, party, cook, do camping, and yeah, exactly. Then you're going to practice all again with the following questions. How often did you, and you're going to answer all of this, like how often did you read in Venezuela? Let's talk about uh, your time in Venezuela. How often did you read in Venezuela? How often did you do yoga in Venezuela? How often did you clean the house in Venezuela, etc. and etc. And the last one is how often does your sister? How often does your sister read? How often does your sister do yoga? How often does your sister clean the house, etc. and etc. Okay, you gotta practice that. Now we're gonna uh, the second part of the exam is describe your visit to the supermarket. So we're going to start practicing vocabulary, okay? Pay, go, went. Okay, remember, very important, the pronunciation we practiced. Went. Remember the T sound. T, t, went. Buy, bought, do did did i'll take take took pounds pounds nuts nuts nut nut Groceries, bag, remember the G sound, g, g, bag, bags, bags, don't, don't, both, okay, the TH sound, very important, both, does, Okay, yeah, remember the pronunciation at the end of each word, okay? Very important. We're going to evaluate that on the exam. And the last thing is just to describe your last visit to the supermarket. This is an example we did on class, but you can do your own, your actual last visit to the supermarket. You can say, well, last visit, my last visit to the supermarket, uh, first I bought um two bags of bread after that i bought three big peppers remember the pronunciation at the end of the words that's the most important part okay Ismar. um i hope to see you tomorrow have a good night